your NORCAST weather update. Brought to you by Square Theatres, South Jersey's premier movie watching experience. Visit our three locations and enjoy the big screen in comfort and style. Tilton Square, Harbor Square, and Ventnor Square. A better way to watch a movie. And good early Saturday morning, meteorologist Bobby Clark here with an update on your forecast. Temperatures out there across the eastern half of the country. On the chillier side, especially across the northern stretches of it, obviously we have some 30s and some 20s out there. Of course, head down towards Florida, very nice 65 degrees in Jacksonville at the moment. But overall, we're going to see ourselves a chillier pattern as we head into the rest of the rest of today and even some snow shower chances as we head through possibly this morning and, all, and uh, into also this afternoon. So definitely be careful of that if you're heading out and about for the area. As we take a little closer to home temperatures right now, 22 in Hamilton, 23 in, in Mays Landing, 20 at the state capitol, run that 195 corridor eastward is a pair of deuces right now in Asbury Park, 21 in Tom's River, 23 in Atlantic City. So these temperatures much cooler than what we're used to here with the cloud cover pushing on in here and a bit of an onshore flow. We'll see that kind of that damp and raw feel to the air itself. Plus, without the sun not feeling great either. And of course, now we'd have a chance of maybe seeing some snow showers out there. Nothing too crazy because the atmosphere is mainly dry and the system is well off to our south. As we can see by the big picture, look where it is. It's all the way down in towards Georgia and Mississippi and Alabama. So really at this point, it's going to be tough to get a lot of moisture to push up here, especially with high pressure in control. But a little bit of that easterly flow in there will give it some moisture. Could see maybe a couple, as I mentioned, snow showers. Nothing in terms of accumulation out there, but again, slick roads, so be careful if you get underneath one of those snow showers that do pop up. So that means for the uh, travel forecast for this morning, again, could maybe see a snow shower or two, but overall not looking too bad out there uh, in terms of any kind of air flights out there that you have, might have. But uh, in terms of driving, again, just be careful if you get into one of those snow showers this morning. Or this afternoon could be obviously a little bit slick in terms of the roadways. Speaking of future casts right now, we'll continue to see these clouds build in here. Again, could see a possible snow shower as we head into this morning and into the, towards the midday hour and into the afternoon itself. But it quickly moves on out of here as we head into the evening hours itself and setting up for us a decent looking Sunday, though we'll see the cloud cover for, I think, most of the day on Sunday. Maybe some sunshine, but then the clouds will build back in as we head towards the evening hours and overnight on into Monday with a chance of maybe seeing a snow shower or even some rain showers later on as we have a warm front that will push on in here as we head towards the morning hours. So the morning commute might be a little bit of an issue, could be a little bit slick there with some rain, even some mix in the Philly burbs. As we look for the rest of today, we'll see a chance of rain and snow showers out there, that easterly flow giving us some moisture, temperatures only getting up into the mid 30s and with that east flow making it feel that much more raw and damp out there, especially get underneath one of those rain and snow showers. As for Sunday, not looking too bad out there. West to southwesterly flow will allow temperatures to rise up into the low to even some mid-50s out there with cloud cover again, pushing in for the morning hours. Could see some clearing as we head into the afternoon and then more clouds as we go to the evening thanks to that warm front pushing in. Could give some rain and snow showers possibly as we head into Monday. Tuesday looking cloudy, we'll see temperatures rising up into the 50s. Same thing with Wednesday and Thursday. And here we go, we hit March, and all of a sudden now we're going to talk about snow all of a sudden, possibly as we head into Friday and even into Saturday. But look at these temperatures dropping back into the mid-30s by the time we hit next weekend. Have a great day, everybody. See you later.